Joan McCloskey regularly visits her local library in Pinckney. Hi, you have a book for me? Sure, why not? But most books Joan picks up don't come from the tiny library outside Ann Arbor. They come from all over the state. I never know where they're going to be from. It's kind of fun. That's because Joan uses the Michigan e-library, or MEL. 300 libraries share books, movies, music, magazines, and thousands of other materials. Every week, she goes online from her home computer and orders books through MEL. In just days, they arrive at the Pinckney Library where she picks them up. I would be totally lost without MEL. Wherever you're requesting, it'll come to your home library for you to pick up. Deb Biggs Thomas is the state's MEL coordinator and she says that's just the beginning. You don't even have to go to the library to get some of the free stuff that MEL offers. There are dozens of free databases that you can access right from home. If you're into researching family genealogy, say, you can click on Heritage Quest. To save on car repairs, Mel has the complete set of Chilton's auto repair manuals. Students who don't want to pay for costly college test prep courses can download standardized practice tests like the ACT and GRE for free. We also have one for business and jobs, which is particularly key in this current economy. And because Mel is tapped into all the academic, public, and school libraries, students can check out textbooks, which can be costly, and download research material at no charge. It's a little-known treasure that makes the job of being a librarian a little easier. This way, our staff and myself don't have to face somebody who will come in and need something and say, I'm sorry, we can't get that for you. Instead, if you have time, <laughs> we can try to borrow that from another place. Are, is that all right with you? And 99% of the time, they'll say, sure. Yes, it's exactly what I wanted. That's great. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Have a good day. I will. Thank you.